Activated charcoal has been used as a medical agent from as far back as 1500 BC. It's most commonly used to treat poisonings by absorbing the toxins from the stomach. The latest beauty trend to hit the internet consists in using activated charcoal to whiten teeth. The theory behind this new craze is that the activated charcoal acts just as it does for other applications. By absorbing toxins from your mouth and teeth, the charcoal supposedly whitens and purifies your teeth in a completely natural and holistic way. Hundreds of videos of people trying this new product can be found online, but is activated charcoal really a miracle whitener or just another case of medical quackery? While the reasoning behind the use of charcoal may seem to make sense, there just isn't any proof that it works in the way that it's designed for. According to dentists, most of the results that people have been seeing are probably the effect of the abrasiveness of the charcoal rather than its toxin-absorbing potential. Furthermore, some oral care professionals warn against brushing your teeth with an abrasive substance on a daily basis as this could have adverse effects on gums and tooth enamel. Dr. Susan Maples, a Michigan-based dentist, says, When you lose enamel, teeth get sensitive and darker in color because you're close to the part of the tooth that has the depth of the color. Since you can't grow it back, the only thing you can do is cover it up with a restoration. So while some short-term results may appear, in the long run, the process could prove to be counterproductive. In any case, those who insist on using activated charcoal as a tooth whitener should only apply it to their teeth for a few minutes without brushing before rinsing it off. That being said, activated charcoal is not meant to replace regular brushing. Store-bought toothpaste also contains fluoride, which is nature's cavity fighter and can cut tooth decay by up to 40%. Needless to say, charcoal won't be replacing the old tube of Aquafresh anytime soon. If you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing to Ponder for more content like this.